Christmas. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the Green <laughs> Family Legacy. Oh, you're so cute, you two. Where Devin has just come home after last time. She has started her first day on the job and she has lost her first day on the job when she was doing some reports and noticed that the woman that she had joined a group to invest money with and try to help local businesses with were actually <sighs> doing it illegally. They were funneling money from local investors, uh, just a little small town, Windenburg folks, right down the street, into uh, into incorrect. Oh, she wants like a cupcake. Like, darling, maybe I should just have something sweet. I I just don't know how to turn all this around. You're a work of art, darling. Don't worry. Oh, they're so cute. Uh, she wants to ask Pine about his day, but she found out that unfortunately, let's ask him for advice. That's so adorable. She rarely comes to him for advice. Normally, it's the other way around. Oh, hang on, you two. Um, reveal brilliant invention. Oh, she hasn't done any yoga in ages. You know what? I feel like I feel like that's what Pine would say. Like, darling, you know what you need is just a nice moment to kind of catch your breath and calm down. What about some some relaxing yoga in the yard? Maybe that sounds perfect for her. She actually has not meditated or done any of her yoga or anything like that since the kids were born, to be completely honest. So let's actually get her the little oom um, my gosh seat. Uh, but yeah, so as you guys know from last time, Devin actually went to her first day on the job so excited she was finally going to begin a new life phase uh being able to work in a business and she thought it was going to be a really great business that was going to be really focused on helping like local women and helping local business people and instead it turned out to be a complete scam uh the women were the woman i should say involved who was going to be like her boss actually was trying to steal money <laughs> Steal money uh, instead of instead of help people. And Devin was so stunned that she just turned her straight into the authorities because she didn't need that kind of nonsense in her life. Are you kidding me? And unfortunately, of course, that means that the business that Devin had just joined immediately went under, which is not ideal. Uh, and now she is finding herself with nowhere to even do yoga. Where the heck? Where the heck do can I even have this woman be able to do her yoga? Is she gonna have to like do mom yoga in the laundry room because it's the only place in the house? <laughs> I guess in the backyard. Maybe she can come do yoga while Pine like works on his woodworking skill for a minute. That seems ironically fitting. Like they can hang out together. They haven't been able to do that in donkey days either. All right, and Devin really loves purple. So we're gonna give her this yoga mat. Um, and actually I could have sworn I had a wellness stool that was like a rock and you could just sit on a rock, which I thought was kind of awesome, but apparently it's missing. So I think having a little wellness stool in the bedroom is a good thing for her. There we go. But yes, yeah, so Devin turned in those shady investors. She was not going to, uh, go ahead and eat little one. I left some food out for you literally right here. No, literally right here, child. Turn around! I did not drag the food all the way upstairs for you to ignore it. Uh, okay, hang on, Devin. I'm coming. All right, and there we go. But yeah, there, and we'll say Pine even brought her some breakfast because she didn't even have time to eat breakfast. So she turned in the group who was completely all uh, lying and stealing from local groups with false investments. Holy cow, Amber is just gaining so much logic. And she got fired, but she got famous. She got famous for doing that. I am so excited. She actually should possibly write uh, not a journal, but she's so sad about this for the next day. I want to see if we can actually write a sad book. I want to see if we can come over here. Can we write a book, a sad book. We're going to write a sad book and it's going to be all about the scandal of Windenburg um, stealing stealing from the piggy bank or stealing from stealing from neighbors 
Uh, yes, we're going to call it that. And she's going to have kind of an expose of the group and hopefully be able to get more fame from the books that she writes to continue to climb up the fame track. Also, I gave her the noticeable, um, the noticeable trait in the end because a lot of them were really good, but I don't want her to really get into the video and music station. That's not really her jam. I do want her to be able to do more networking with famous Sims, but I feel like at level one, it's better for her to gain fame from doing things that make her stand out a little bit through her skills and through her career-based actions. So I'm pretty excited about that. Hopefully, hopefully we'll be able to make this girl famous. Also, give me just a second. I need to remember if self-publishing or selling to publisher. Selling to a publisher will grant a moderate amount of royalties, which you receive daily. A small amount, self-publishing. Okay, I think I wanna sell to publisher. And I also want to get multiple copies of her book that she wrote, the From Seed to Success. But let me see how I can get multiple copies of that. Aha! I found it! Okay, so From Seed to Success. I haven't published it yet. Thank freaking goodness. We're going to put it down. Um, we're going to go ahead and put From Seed to Success, which is, of course, kind of like a fashion-y like, book. I love it. I absolutely love it. And then I think you can come over... Nothing here can be cloned! Come on, make a copy! Create copy! Okay. We're gonna create some copies of her book, like two or three copies, and then we will sell a copy to a publisher to see if we can get a little bit of fame, and I will have her write Stealing from Neighbors, an expose. Oh, Pine, you freaking adorable father, you! There we go. And we're gonna create another copy. I just wanna make sure that I have, like, copies all over this house. Okay, there's a second copy. Let's go ahead and drop one copy up here. That was just, no, just one copy. <laughs> Give me back my books. Uh, what's this? Bangers are the worst? That's so odd. Uh, all right, let's do that. And then I should have open, yes, the buyer beware chest down here, which is kind of going to be like our little attic chest. I have a special mod from Braz and Lotus, I believe, which means that these items no longer share inventories. So I can have multiple versions of them, I'm pretty sure. Let me go ahead and put this one down. And they should not share yeah, they do not share inventories anymore. So I can have like a special me memento chest for Devin and I can have a special memento chest for Pine. I should probably have like little pictures of them over the spots, but now I can go ahead and like, oh, hilariously tiny T-Rex arms. Devin, how do you even have that? That's so cute. Let me just go, oh, and her amethyst. Oh, I forgot about the way it recharges the hunger skill and it gives logic boost. What? That's so cool. I forgot how she used to have her gemstones and she was really into gemstones. Wow. I think she can give some of this to the family. Like all those upgrade parts can go to him. Bacon Knight, we'll give some of those to the kids. Tate's Essence of Happiness. Tate, I guess we can drink from Grandpa Tate's Essence of Happiness. That's so creepy. We can get rid of the health potion. And we can put all the rest of those books away. Uh, but I really love that. I've been meaning to actually try to make it so that I can have little uh, attic chest and more pictures uh, that the family can like stick in the attic up in the barn. And then, oh, that's right. One of our cow plants died again. No. <laughs> but I wanted to do that so that we can... Um, we can say that the family like has memory boxes and we can look back in future generations and be like wow do you remember this i totally forgot about it this is so exciting uh all right let's go ahead and put that in her inventory how do i put it in her inventory rename from season to success study read for, create copy oh, i guess now i have to create a copy of it again okay that's fine Oh, no, that's because her son was trying to put it away. Put it down, Aspen. Down, child. Drop it. That's your mom's... That's your mom's book. That's your mom's memento book. Put it down. Aspen, thank you. Thank you very much. Devin, there you go. Uh, all right, but yes. Sorry, I'm very excited about all the drama that has happened. Um, then I'm going to have her... 
come down, sell the publisher. Let's have her pay the bills. And then after that, we're going to sell her book to the publisher and we're going to have her start working on writing a book, stealing from your neighbors so that we can really have that expose I'm looking for. Uh, read Herbalism Volume 2, More to Brew. Allison, I am going to take note that you want to be doing more with like herbalism, but I really do need you to come outside and start weeding all these plants. Oh, Oh, Tate! Hey! Grandpa Tate just came over! And he wanted to do some gardening! That is so freaking sweet! Are you here for coffee, Tate? Gosh! Let's let's be thankful. Maybe, like, banter with our dad? That's so exciting that his dad came over. I'm so glad that we, we gave Tate some residence keys so that he can just, like, come over whenever he wants. Uh, let's give residence. I thought we gave him residence keys. You should be able to come over whenever you want, Tate. There we go. That's gonna be very happy for Pine. <gasps> Devin! Look at it this way. As soon as you finish... Okay, you paid the bills. What? We got fame from paying the bills? Or was that fame from selling the book already? It's out in the world. Now each day, Devin will earn a moderate amount of royalties. Well, that's good. See, Devin, you don't need to be too terribly sad. And then let's update your social media status, maybe. <laughs> While fame is still hot. Um, and then let's go ahead. <laughs> she's so sad. This is why is that so cute? And then while she's still wearing the terrible tacky outfit that she had to wear, we're going to have her come over and write a sad book because I've never written an emotional book before. There you go, you guys. Allison, where are you going? You're possessing... <laughs> You're possessing the children's slide. That's fine. I see how it is. Also, would you two come home if you're miserable? Oh, Devin's getting some followers. So she is getting some attention from all of this chaos. Maybe that can help console her for what's been going on. And she has a little bit of a good reputation now. Oh, let's have an even better reputation. Devin, before you write the sad book, let's have her come over. Can we donate? A oh, we can donate a bunch of money. <gasps> okay, let's donate a ton of money to, to prove that we are totally outside of this. We're going to donate to the Foundation for Less Mischief as our way of saying like, we will, I am going to put my own personal money from my family's farm behind the local businesses that were scammed out of their, their funds. So let's donate some money. Hopefully that won't boost her so much that we lose our fun ability to write a sad book, as sad as that sounds. Allison, hang on. You need to get back out here and do some... Uh, they should already be perfect. Oh, they're magnificent, but not perfect. Allison, come fertilize them with the magnificent quality roses you have. Come, my dear. We have so much to do. Also, Fern, come home. Like, seriously, lady. If you and Toby are miserable, come home. You shouldn't have been walking the dog all day to the point of literal physical misery. Uh, and Amber, you should do a little bit of cleaning up so that we can start getting your badges. Oh, I'm so excited about this. All right. Bye, Tate. Oh, she's so sad, but look, we're going to donate the money. It's going to be okay. I'm actually going to have this guy call his mom. Uh, hey, Allison. There's Iris. I'm just going to have her, him chat with his mom because Tate stopped by. But see, we are donating money from our very own family's welfare. <laughs> oh, she's so sad. The charity is appre appreciative of the sizable donation. Thanks to Devin Spence uh, and thanks Devin Spence on their newsletter. Nice. Did that help our reputation? I think, oh, I think it helped our fame a little bit too. Oh, <laughs> Now we are not sad anymore. Gosh darn it. I was really hoping we would be sad. <laughs> as terrible as it sounds. Let's get her a new job with business again. Oh, Iris, you come on over, Grandma. If you want to. Unfortunately, Fern is not a good one to hang out with because she's about to pass out. Uh, back into the business career, guys. Round two. 
Devin is an assistant manager at a new group. So we're going to start our own little business, I think. Uh, Devin is just going to go ahead and say that, you know what? That didn't work. I'm not going to give up. We're going to try um, berry, cowberry, uh, cowberry acres. Mm, I don't know what to call it. Let's see. This is Windenburg. The neighbors were being cheated. Hmm, better harvest. Let's call it better harvest. Just a small little local group to help the the local populace. So this is going to be for better harvest. So that everybody will be able to focus on um focus on making better use of the local She's still so sad. But I think it's going down faster now that she's so freaking happy. <laughs> Uh, but after four hours, we might be able to write that sad book again. Who's this child? A friend! Oh my gosh, Aspen, where are you? You're already super playful. Come and introduce yourself to Kingo Wantabe. He's even wearing a little bee shirt, so maybe that's maybe that's a good sign. Oh, and the cow plant died. Oh, I hate it when that happens. Poor thing. That wasn't supposed to happen. I feel like whenever a cow plant dies, part of my heart does too. Um, but we'll go ahead and stick it in the basement with the other one. <laughs> you never know what you find in family basements, you know what I mean? So I don't think this is as creepy as it seems on the surface. And Allison, that means you need to grab one of the cow plant berries from our copious stockpile here that we've got. And we're going to plant this little guy. Because one of the rules that we have for living here with the zoning codes is that we always need to have six cow plants here. So I'm going to have Allison. I'm going to let her come over. Oh, she can appreciate the cow plant berry. And then she can go ahead and plant it. There we go. And then I'm going to have her go ahead and water all and harvest all of the snapdragons. We've got a lot to do. You, sir, I guess you can you can play with these guys if you want to, I suppose. You go ahead, play with, maybe milk them. A lot of them need milked. All right. What a day. Devin has finally stepped her high-heeled toes into fame, and unexpectedly, it had everything to do with um, with an illegal business that she squashed. And she's going to begin Better Harvest. Lonely recess. Last recess, no one wanted to play with me. I just climbed around on my own. If I if it happens again, what should I do? Um, talk to the teacher. Just play on your own. Ask the other kids to join in. I feel like Devin would say, you should talk to the teacher, darling, and see if there's some extra work that you could be doing in class. There we go. Which it would at least increase manners, but... Oh, I think that actually Amber has very poor... <gasps> she has terrible emotional control. Oh, she's going to be so fun to play without that. Oh, my goodness. Uh, all right. Well, Amber, let's go ahead and check you out, my dear. <gasps> Civic responsibility and social ability. Oh, my gosh. Let's have her collect both those badges and see what happens. So we're making progress. We are making progress. I really want Devin to become sad in a few hours oh my gosh we're a unicorn scout now we have a scouting trophy that would make her so freaking excited where is my scouting trophy are you kidding me she would be all over that is it in our inventory where's our scouting trophy I want our scouting trophy. I have no idea what these are, so we'll just move them. I don't know why I haven't been able to get these items. Are they going to come in the mail? Like, are they in the mail? Where is all of this? Oh, dear. I didn't get the scouting manual either, so I'm going to find that scouting trophy. But uh, let's see. View badge progress. I think Amber would be extremely excited now. Gosh, and she has like her last day of school tomorrow, which is going to be or going to be so interesting. 
So now she could focus on the good deeds, entertaining a toddler, making someone laugh, taking out the trash, or helping someone with their homework. She could focus on the keeping fit, the arts and crafts from making drawings or paintings, giving back from donating items for charity at the mailbox or computer, or giving gifts. Interesting. Ooh, finding frogs, catching fish. I think that she is going to focus on the arts and crafts next because that's going to be so easy. Are you kidding me? That's just completely easy to do. Um, yeah, we'll have her sit down. Uh, we'll have her maybe appreciate this new object of her interest. There we go. Did that count as cleaning up? Nope. Oh, Aspen's going to, through a phase. He's clingy right now because he was trying to meet a new friend and then he actually got a little too nervous. And he's like, Mom! Dad! Oh, geez, that's so cute. All right. Well, we're doing good here. Make fall crafts, make holiday crafts. Let's draw some people and we'll get arts and crafts going. There we go. All right, well, somebody is feeling a little bit overwhelmed from having had a friend over. But all right, guys, so thank you guys so much for joining me. This has taken some really exciting turns. This is why I love, love, love legacy families. You just never know where it's going to go. And you can just keep going and keep going. Hmm. Green family roots. I might want to disband some of these clubs, but I'll have to think about it. You can just keep going and kind of watch as the stories play out. So, thank you guys so much. Where is Toby? Toby? Here, boy. Let's get him to come home. Man, taking your dog on a walk can be a little bit dangerous, apparently, because they'll just stay lost for ages. Oh, my goodness. And somebody is having fun drawing people. Yeah, I'm having a great time, even though... Even though things have gotten quite dramatic. But alright, so we may actually have Devin teach her children how to do donations because it will help everybody. We'll have to see if I can continue to keep her sad long enough, as weird as that sounds, to write a sad book. Um, like, stealing from neighbors or something like that. I'm going to have to give it some thought on what I want to call it. And I will see you guys next time. So if you could, what's up, Devin? I heard your name is all the buzz lately. How do you feel about catching up? I mean, we were always friends before you made it big, right? Ah! And she's getting famous for doing good deeds in town. That's absolutely fantastic. Oh, I love this. But all right. So if you could do please a like to help out, leave a like to help out the Green Family Legacy. And if you would wa like to watch over their family tree, do please consider subscribing and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>